on. Jesus Christ. What's going on guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Curtis and today we're hitting Box Canyon with a fellow buddy. He's got the Icon Stage 5 kit on his truck and we're going to go rip it around and see how it does. Oh, you're not gonna hit nothing. Don't worry, you're not gonna hit nothing. The bumper. Oh, wow. He told me. Yeah, well, he said, no, you, you can drive, you won't hit nothing. Don't worry. <laughs> Fucking proceeds to hit every single thing. Uh, yeah. You're stuck on your dick. Hurt. Leaking oil? Oh yeah. Maybe I should put it four wheel drive. What do you think? I tell he's, you what, I'm not he's nervous. Away. You have more ground clearance than I do. Finn is nervous. I take a picture of that. This is the situation mm. right now. Oh. oh yeah. Oh well. 
Uh, I don't think it was bumper. I don't, th I don't think it was bumper. It was, it was lower control arm. Oh, really? I think so. I don't see shit. Yeah. These tires are definitely pretty big. <laughs> yeah, you had it all the Bumper way. held up strong. They flex a lot better than the RTs, though, at episode. Yeah. We're trying to, you know, just test out the bumper uh, clearances and the new tire flex, and uh, she definitely rubs. Um, we probably should have paid more attention to the line we were taking, but uh, we just kind of went for it and laid the, the yeah, laid the diff on a rock. So um, awesome. Yeah, we're having fun out here. Finley loved it. Yeah, he's having fun. So, yeah. <laughs> so keep going on the trail and keep uh, our, our stuff up. I don't remember that spot last time. I really don't. Uh, your truck's bigger than mine, so I decided not. <laughs> I decided that was a bad idea. <laughs>
with this beautiful view out here. It's hot as balls. It's about like 90 degrees already in Arizona. So just hanging out with the 270 up, the new ground 270, even after busting it on that rock. She's still, still solid. So we're hanging out and uh, enjoying the views. What do you think, Finn? What do you think? Side of your truck, and I have shit on my tires too. Yeah, <laughs> he's got poopy on your truck. Like, Actually, he, yeah, poopy, bro. Like, like, like shit. Like shit. I don't know if that's human shit, but it's brown, like human so shit. Brown. Like I'm fucking. I saw it in my tire when I'm like looking at my tire when you're filming, and I'm like, oh, it stinks. And I look at my tread. There's a fat chunk of shit <laughs> on my tread. That's gross. All right, dude. <laughs> Go How do you feel about that? Wow. Yeah, wow. Clean, clean out some human shit on the way fucking Look, home. There you go. Oh, yeah. Maybe it was cow shit. I don't think human shit that big. No, I don't think so. I mean, I have some morning, but. There's. I have one this morning. <laughs> We're almost done with the trail. It was a pretty little fun obstacle there. Uh, I somehow hit every single thing on the truck and we guided him through nothing. He just got two inches lift and uh, yeah, we're gonna keep going on this trail. Um, and then we're gonna have fun. Yeah. yeah we're gonna have fun. So we're almost done. Almost Stock done. Stock shocks need a change. It gets bumpy after an hour. So. Mm -hmm. It's bad. I'm trying to crochet here and I can't really do it. Yeah, I don't know how she's doing that.
today's video. The homie left already with the Icon kit, and uh, it was really nice getting to ride in his rig with a nice suspension. Um, the stock stuff is just not cutting it. Um, I got, I'm, I have a dilemma right here. ADS, peak suspension, or Icon? I'm not entirely sure which one I want to go with. I support peak so much because they do so much for the GM community. And ADS is sick racing stuff. Icon's dope. So it's up to you guys. What brand do you think I should go with? I'll show you guys the damage on the truck from today's trail. All right, so skid plate did its job. We hit it a couple times in the front, but uh, the OEM Chevy one definitely would have been destroyed and bent up even more. So that's nice, held strong, no dents, nothing, just a little, uh, little paint scratch. And as it is for the rock sliders, a bunch of work towards the rock sliders. We definitely uh, scrape those bad boys up a little bit more. And for the 35 1250s, we are rubbing a bunch on that plastic piece, so I'm gonna have to figure out, pull this guy, put some plugs in there, right there, and do some do something right here. So that's fun. Just rubbing on that little guy in the corner, so we, we can figure something out. But overall, I'm loving the 35 1250 look. Looks nice and mean, big truck style, you know what I mean? All right, for the rear bumper, so high clearance, never hit it, hit the hitch and that's about it. So rear bumper's holding in, the truck is dirty as shit. And uh, yeah, nothing really damage wise besides sliders, front bumper, a little scratchy scratch, rubbing a bit right there, but that's it. What the hell? All right guys, so that's about it for today's video. We got the roof rack coming on pretty soon. So we got that ordered up. So I think we got three weeks I think we got three weeks until the roof rack is coming on and uh, hoping my truck makes it to Overland Expo. I have a downtime lost wrap going on the truck, kind of decal and er decal sponsors and everything like that. Kate's designing for me right now. So that's gonna look sick. I'm loving the look of the truck right now. So, and uh, today's trail is pretty, pretty easy. A couple of spots, you know, having fun out there. But uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys watching so much. I love you. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more awesome videos from the truck. So we need suspension. So that's a uh, number one priority right now. So, all right, love you guys. Peace out.